Archaeologists discovered many strange things, but each find raises more questions. It seems like the marks were meant to trap curious people. These discoveries are keeping scientists and scholars up at night. From weird human species to creepy marks, these findings could change how we see history. Let's explore the surprising discoveries together. Hunting Pits Below Stonehenge Below Stonehenge is Wiltshire, England. There's a famous circle of huge standing stones that was fascinating people worldwide for years. These stones, some towering 30 feet high and weighing tons, were initially believed to have astronomical and religious significance, linked to celestial observations and possibly serving as a calendar. However, recent archaeological discoveries uncovered a new mystery beneath Stonehenge's surface. Thousands of hunting pits surround the monument, dating back to about 10,000 years ago, a staggering 5,000 years before Stonehenge was built. One particularly massive pit, 13 feet wide and 6.5 feet deep, stands out as the largest in northwest Europe. This finding indicates that communities existed in the area during the early Mesolithic period, marking a significant era in Britain's repopulation after the last ice age. These ancient pits offer insights into the activities of people, revealing the transition from early hunter-gatherer groups to later farming communities over millennia. The connection between these hunting pits and Stonehenge enriches our understanding of the region's history and the evolution of human societies. The Chinese may have discovered America. People recently found some old stones in the southern part of the United States, and it's making them think that maybe the Chinese were some of the first explorers in America. What's interesting about these stones is that they have messages written in an ancient Chinese script called Oracle Bone Script. This script is really old and was used for asking questions by engraving them on animal bones. The decoded messages on these stones tell a story about a journey, suggesting that the Chinese might have come to North America over 3,000 years ago. If this turns out to be true, it would change what we know about early exploration and settlement in the Americas. The idea that the Chinese might have visited North America before Columbus challenges what we thought we knew about history. If these findings are confirmed, it means that ancient Chinese people could have traveled long distances across the ocean, which makes us rethink what we know about ancient civilizations and how they shared knowledge across faraway places. Rosetta Stone The Rosetta Stone began as an ordinary piece of stone but turned into one of the most important discoveries in recent centuries. Found in Egypt in 1799, it plays a crucial role in uncovering secrets of the past. The stone is special because it has inscriptions in three scripts, Greek, Demotic, and Hieroglyphics. This combination proved to be the key to solving the mystery of hieroglyphics that had puzzled experts for a long time. The Rosetta Stone is a turning point in understanding ancient Egypt's symbolic script. It bridges the gap between the past and the present, allowing us to explore the history and culture of this fascinating civilization. Scholars successfully decoded hieroglyphics using the Greek part of the stone, unlocking the door to Egypt's ancient mysteries. This single artifact marked a significant moment in the quest for human understanding, providing valuable insights into a culture that continues to captivate our imaginations. Water on Mars People used to think Mars and other planets might have had life in the past, but now scientists found something new about Mars. Even though it looks dry and empty now, NASA found proof that Mars had a huge ocean a long time ago, covering a big part of the top part. This is a big deal because it means ancient Mars might have been better for life than we thought. With a big ocean, Mars could have been warm and wet, conditions that are good for life to grow. This discovery is important because it changes what we know about Mars's history. It suggests that Mars wasn't always a cold, dry place. Having a big ocean means Mars might have been a nice place for life to live a long time ago. Finding liquid water, which is important for life like ours, makes scientists think Mars might have had life or at least a place where life could have survived in the past. Strange Artifacts Found in Lake Titicaca South America's largest lake, shared by Peru and Bolivia, has revealed intriguing artifacts that fascinated marine archaeologists. In its deep waters, divers discovered a well-preserved ceremonial site known as the Coa Reef. Submerged about 16 feet underwater, the artifacts include remnants of sacrificed llamas and elaborately crafted gold ornaments dating back to the 8th to 10th centuries. 
These discoveries predate the Spanish conquest and offer insights into the pre-Inca Tiwanaku people, who occupied the region with a population of around 1 million. The artifacts, including gold decorations and sacrificial animals, suggest connections to religious events or ancient traditions that played a vital role in the progress of the Tiwanaku civilization. Among the finds, an exceptionally crafted item raises questions about the technological capabilities of the Tiwanaku people during that time. The relics from Lake Titicaca continue to captivate, providing a glimpse into ancient South American civilizations, their traditions, and the mysteries they hold. Signs in Cresswell Cracks Throughout generations, humanity has been haunted by fears of the supernatural, from ghosts and vampires to witches. This fear gripped Europe from the 1400s to the late 1700s, resulting in the tragic deaths of 40 to 60,000 people suspected of practicing witchcraft. In Cresswell Crags, a limestone gorge in the United Kingdom, mysterious witch signs are etched into the crevices. These markings, dating back to the Ice Age, reveal the human instinct to protect against unseen harmful powers. Mistaken for modern graffiti at first glance, these symbols serve as tangible reminders of a time when superstition and terror prevailed. To ward off evil or supernatural threats, our ancestors carved these protective symbols in hidden places. This archaeological discovery sheds light on humanity's enduring efforts to guard against perceived magical and unknown dangers. Pumapunku Pumapunku, near Tuanaco in Bolivia, is an ancient site from around 536 AD, shrouded in mystery. It holds cultural importance in Inca customs and adds to the enigma of Tuanaco, considered the cradle of the planet. The site's precise architecture, featuring neatly cut doorways and stone slabs with minimal chisel marks, puzzles archaeologists. Debates persist about how the massive stone blocks were transported and placed. Some believe ancient Tuanaco laborers collectively quarried and moved the stones, while others suggest llama skin ropes and ramps. Skeptics argue that given the immense weight of some stones, about 131 metric tons, these methods might have been insufficient, making it challenging even with available resources. Pumapunku's mysteries continue to captivate historians, leading to investigations into advanced prehistoric civilizations and more speculatively, the potential of extraterrestrial intervention. Sunken City of Duaca The Sunken City of Duaca is an underwater archaeological marvel in the Arabian Sea off the western coast of India. Believed to represent the legendary Duaca city from ancient Indian scriptures like the Mahabharata and Puranas, its potential predating of some of the world's oldest civilizations makes this discovery significant. Duaca, according to Hindu legend, was the capital of Krishna's dominion. Previously considered mere tales, recent underwater excavations in the Gulf of Kambat have unveiled ruins dating back thousands of years. The exact age is debated, with some suggesting it could be as old as 9,000 years, potentially placing it among the world's oldest known urban settlements. If accurate, this dating has the power to reshape our understanding of early human civilization and city origins. The sunken city of Dwarka challenges existing paradigms and is a treasure trove of knowledge, urging us to reconsider the origins and development of human communities. It serves as a reminder that history is an ever-changing narrative and ancient tales may have roots in real physical findings beneath the sea. Women Viking In Viking societies, women enjoyed great respect and freedom with tales of famous female warriors prevalent in Scandinavian tradition and Middle Ages poetry. While official historical narratives often questioned these stories, recent discoveries of weapons and equipment buried with female skeletons provide undeniable evidence of women's combat roles. One notable find is the Burka warrior grave in Sweden, dating back to the 10th century. This burial site offers tangible archaeological proof of women holding high-ranking positions in Viking culture. DNA analysis confirmed the gender of the warrior, identifying her as a woman over the age of 30, standing at about 5 foot 6 inches tall. This genetic verification marked a significant milestone in proving the existence of female Viking fighters, according to Professor Matthias Jacobson. The story of female Viking warriors doesn't end there. Another fearless fighter's skeletal remains were discovered in a graveyard in Sola, Norway, currently exhibited at Oslo's Museum of Cultural History. 
The presence of lethal weapons near her supports the theory that women actively played combat roles in Viking society. Copper Scroll The Copper Scroll, discovered among the Dead Sea Scrolls in 1952, is a unique artifact in a collection of Jewish holy literature from the Second Temple period. This scroll is distinctive because it's believed to be a catalogue of hidden valuables stashed before the Roman siege of Jerusalem in 70 AD. Among the concealed treasures are gold, silver, and other valuable items, with some speculating that the fabled Ark of the Covenant could be included. The intrigue surrounding this scroll has led to numerous missions and treasure hunts in search of the wealth it supposedly catalogued. However, the Copper Scroll remains secretive, requiring an understanding of its obscure language and historical context. The language is a variant of Hebrew, but the script is unusual, making translation and interpretation challenging even with our present linguistic expertise. The Copper Scroll and its cryptic content serve as a reminder that history is not a straightforward journey from point A to point B. Our historical narrative is complex, filled with mysteries and uncertainties that only deepen our fascination with the past. Akrotiri The image showcases the remarkably well-preserved excavation site of Akrotiri, a location that has sparked debates about its potential connections to the legendary Atlantis. The ancient city of Akrotiri met a fate similar to Pompeii, being buried in volcanic ash after a cataclysmic eruption in 1620 BC. Despite this event being lost to history, its rediscovery in the 1960s has revealed a treasure trove of ancient riches and a glimpse into a prosperous era. The well-preserved walls of Akrotiri boast magnificent paintings realistically depicting Bronze Age life, offering valuable insights into Mediterranean sea trade and Minoan creativity. The excavation has enhanced our understanding of this vanished city and broadened our historical context of the Mediterranean region. Denisovans The Denisovans, a supposed ancient human species flourishing tens of thousands of years ago, are considered by some to be close ancestors alongside Neanderthals. Our understanding of this enigmatic group primarily relies on DNA extracted from a finger bone and a few teeth found in Siberia's Denisova cave. What sets Denisovans apart is the scarcity of tangible evidence compared to Neanderthals, whose skeletons have been discovered worldwide. Due to limited physical remains, questions about Denisovans' physical traits, actions, and intelligence persist. However, their heritage persists in modern human DNA, indicating interbreeding with our ancestors, apparently. An Oxford study uncovered a remarkable discovery, a 90,000-year-old individual named Denny, a first-generation hybrid born to a Neanderthal mother and a Denisovan father. Denny's unique lineage offers insights into the interbreeding of Neanderthals and Denisovans, providing valuable knowledge about their behaviors, adaptations, and genetic contributions in paleoanthropology. In the 4th century, a team of sewage workers tasked with repairing a burst pipe stumbled upon a groundbreaking discovery. Their fortunate find was a hidden staircase, and with an archaeologist on site, they unearthed strange ancient artifacts. Over years of excavation, part of the famous Pool of Shiloh was revealed, an immense ritual bath used by thousands of Jewish pilgrims during festivals. They also uncovered an ancient road from the city of David to the pool and onward to the temple. The paved street, dating to the late Second Temple period or first century AD, signifies the continued importance of the area. This unexpected historic discovery unfolded beneath the old city of Jerusalem. Sarcophagus beneath Notre Dame de Paris. Notre Dame de Paris, renowned worldwide, faced a major change on April 15, 2019, when a devastating fire consumed its roof. Immediate restoration efforts, ongoing until 2024, led to the discovery of two mysterious sarcophagi beneath the cathedral's nave. Through meticulous research, information about the buried individuals emerged. The first sarcophagus lightly holds the ashes of a high priest named Anthony of Padua, evident from clues on the deteriorating coffin, suggesting a history of food and alcohol consumption. The second casket contains the remains of an unnamed man, potentially a horseback rider, known as Le Cavalier. Both were interred in lead coffins, a tradition for the aristocracy. Despite close identification attempts based on bones, much remains to be learned about their lives and the potential consequences their histories may entail. Cylon Followers Outside Athens, a disconcerting sight awaits passers-by, an ancient mass grave with dozens of skeletons. 
What makes this discovery unsettling is that several of these skeletons wear iron shackles. This somber collection of 80 bones serves as a heartbreaking memorial to a bygone era, with 36 of them bound by iron shackles, an evocative metaphor for their situation. Archaeologists date these remains back to a dark time between 650 to 625 BC. Through rigorous investigation and analysis, historical sources point to an ancient coup in 632 BC orchestrated by Olympic champion Cylon in an attempt to control Athens. While evidence is limited, archaeologists speculate that these skeletons may belong to Cylon's devoted followers who lost their lives as a consequence of their allegiance to his ill-fated cause. New Mayan City The square-shaped platform depicted here could hold the key to unraveling the secrets of a previously unknown Mayan city, a groundbreaking discovery credited to the resourcefulness of 15-year-old Canadian William Gadry. His innovative perspective on Mayan culture proposes that these ancient people strategically located their cities by aligning them with celestial constellations. Gadry's hypothesis suggests the presence of another secret metropolis in Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. While his theory is based on intriguing assumptions, satellite images of this enigmatic metropolis have stirred excitement among archaeologists and scholars. An expedition to this unexplored Mayan city is on the horizon, driven by the promise of unveiling a new chapter in Mayan history and deepening our understanding of this ancient civilization's complexities. And that wraps up today's exploration. Join us in our next adventure as we continue to unveil the secrets hidden beneath the layers of history. Thanks for watching.